create a visit to the sphere. As you can see, as we uh, um, know that at the end of chapter 7, Philip was arrested and imprisoned in the Bastille, and the three musketeers ran away to hide in their secret place, the new secret place. Let's go and see what will Dachtanian do. Let's go through the vocal first. Dim, less light, almost no light. Glow, lighting. Heap, a pile, a group of things placed on one another. A heap of straw. Taken on fight. Jersey, wet and slippery. Jailer, a person who is in charge of a jail guard. What about our new instance? Of course, we all know that D'Artagnan chose to be with the musketeers. Okay? So he had to see his friends. But to see his friends, he had to disguise and run away from Fouquet's spies, and that's what happened. D'Artagnan wanted to see his friends at their new secret place at St. John Church, but Fouquet had his spies after him all the time. What did D'Artagnan do? He had to hide in a cart with three goats, okay, to go to the church without being noticed. Of course, can you imagine uh, the uh, smell would be a uh, uh, good or nasty smell? So why did D'Artagnan smell bad after his journey to the church? Because he shared a carrot with three goats in order to get to the church unnoticed. Okay, what a lousy smell. Whom did D'Artagnan meet at the church, the first person was a priest, whom he was surprised to see, a musketeer, D'Artagnan, in the church and thought that he was one of the king's men and he was afraid of him, he didn't trust D'Artagnan. D'Artagnan um, told D'Artagnan in an angry voice that people in of France dying in the streets D'Artagnan replied, answered, that he was here in the church to see Aramis for this reason and to assure the priest that he is a friend and not an enemy and he gave him his ring with a cross of um, uh, St. George Church on it to be sure of this, okay? So D'Artagnan met the priest and told him that he wanted to meet Aramis and gave him his ring to trust him. Why was the priest afraid of D'Artagnan? Because the priest thought that he was the king's man since he was wearing the uniform of the musketeers. Now, what happened after the priest showed the ring to Aramis? The priest led D'Artagnan to the secret cellar where the musketeers were hiding, okay? And where is this cellar? In a small room, in a small room next to the church and through a small trap door in the floor of the little room next to the church, they can go inside. Can you see this opening area? It's where you go into the cellar. Okay. What happened when they saw D'Artagnan? At first, they thought that D'Artagnan forgot about them. But once they saw D'Artagnan, they were reassured again that he was still their friend and that he is with them against King Louis. Okay. So they greeted him warmly. But why did D'Artagnan go? 
there only to see his friends and make sure that they are all right or he had another plan of course Dachtinian had another plan and he didn't give up on Philip and his friends what was the new plan Dachtinian told his friends that he had a plan to get Philip out of the Bastille which was a, a mad plan because no one had ever tried such a thing. Okay, what was D'Artagnan Ba'a, the details of the plan to put Philippe on the throne of France? His plan was to get Philippe out of the Bastille. How? To be dressed as musketeers, but this time they would take D'Artagnan as a prisoner who is a traitor and who planned to kill the king, okay? And they would put D'Artagnan, the prisoner, in the same cellar with the man in the iron mask, the other traitor. Tab, how would this happen? It would happen by the seals, the people sealed from the king himself, telling the guards in the Bastille that these musketeers are the only one to put this prisoner into the same cell with Philippe, the man in the iron mask, with the other traitor. Okay, but how did D'Artagnan manage to get these seals? As the captain of King's Guards, he has the access to the seals of the king, so he can easily seal any paper he wanted, and that's what D'Artagnan did. Okay? Let's read together together. His plan was to get Philippe out of the Bastille as they would be dressed as musketeers and D'Artagnan would be their prisoner. They would put him themselves in the same cell with Philippe. As soon as the cell door was open, what will they do? They will push D'Artagnan inside and tie up the guards, take Philippe and escape. Okay? What surprise had D'Artagnan for the musketeers? What had D'Artagnan brought for them, for his friends? He brought them their old uniforms as musketeers. Why? Why did he keep these uniforms all this time? Because D'Artagnan thought that one day they might use them. How did the four musketeers manage to enter the Bastille? When the guards wore, saw the uniforms of the king's musketeers, they opened the iron door at once and let them in. Of course, they then they got the seals they needed. They told the head jailer they had a traitor who tried to kill the king and also they had orders to put him in the same cell of the man in the iron mask by themselves. What happened when the four musketeers came into Philippe's cell? They pushed D'Artagnan, who thought for a second that they, are going to, they were going to leave him, but this didn't happen. It was only acting. And they tied the head jailer up, put a cloth into his mouth to keep him quiet and took Philippe out. How could the four musketeers get out of the Bastille? Of course, you know that the Bastille is a fearful place. It's very uh, um, uh, rough. Uh, let's see Kedam, what happened. After they went out of Philippe's cell, they met many guards, two groups of guards. Among these guards, um, of course, they can deal with these guards, but among these guards were two musketeers holding muskets. One who shot uh, uh, two bullets, one uh, uh, D'Artagnan and Porthos missed, and the other bullet D'Artagnan missed, but it shot Porthos in his side, okay? And he was seriously injured. The passages were narrow, so it was so hard for guards to fight them at once. 
Only that? No. It was a tradition or a rule for the musketeers. If someone is injured or someone is important and they want to keep him alive and safe, what will they do? They would make a circle around this person and fight back to back. And that's what happened, what the musketeers did. The three musketeers and Philippe made the circle around Porthos and fought back to back to protect him. They could deal with the last ten guards and ran away with horses, which were with Aramis's, out of the prison. They went back of to the church of St. John, galloping through uh, uh, the streets of Paris, okay, and Porthos was badly injured. Now, again, let's get a, um, um, a stress on. Who was injured in the escape? Porthos was injured, was shot. Where did the musketeers escape to? They escaped to the church of St. John. And this is your uh, chapter, the underlined parts. Okay, this is the end of our chapter, chapter 8. Of course, you know that chapter 9 and 10 um, are for reading only. They are not included in the term exam. So, study well. Thank you very much for your listening and caring.